Having spent Good Friday reflecting on the pain and death of Jesus, we now enter Holy Saturday, a day of silence, of waiting, of hope. Today, let us focus on the perfect follower of Jesus, our most beloved mother. Mary's entire life was a prolonged yes to the Lord, right from the Annunciation to the Crucifixion. She is the only one who stood by him in thick and thin. Her yes stands strong till the end at the foot of the cross. What must have been Mary's thoughts on that quiet Saturday? Surely she must have looked back and seen her little babe at Bethlehem, his simple childhood at Nazareth, her worry when he was lost in the temple, his assistance towards Joseph at Carpentry, his nobility during the three years of his public life. She certainly remembered the baby born to her 33 years ago, recalling the moments she spent with him and held him in her arms. But how different and heartbroken she must have felt to see the lifeless body of Jesus placed on her lap. Her only son, so badly tortured and killed as a ransom for the sins of humanity, the same humanity which she was now called to mother. Can we, her children, not bring consolation and joy to her heart? All we need to do is follow her words. Do whatever he tells you. That is all she asks of us, to do what Jesus wants, to live his way, the way of service and prayer, of forgiveness and love.